I'm sure that you guys, unless you've been living under a rock for the past eight months, have heard of the Frank Body Coffee Scrub. There has been a lot of hype going on about these. A couple of months ago, I decided that I would pick them up myself to try them out and see what the hype was all about. And I can say that I 100% agree with the hype about these. They are amazing products. They make your skin feel really, really soft. They exfoliate your skin really well. They moisturize your skin and they also get rid of cellulite. And I think if you have skin issues like eczema or scarring or anything like that, which I don't have that, but I have heard that it gets rid of that as well. However, there are a couple of things about these that I don't like. One being the fact that they come in these paper bags and I guess I could just deep pop them into little um, jars or something if I wanted to but I haven't been bothered to so maybe I shouldn't complain about that. See, this one's kind of got like shower stuff all over it and I just don't really like it. I find it hard to get out of the bag and stuff like that. And they are also pretty expensive considering the amount of product that you get or maybe I'm just using a ton and I'm not meant to be but I tend to go through these pretty quickly. So I decided that I would make my own coffee scrub and in this video today I'm going to show you guys how you can make your very own DIY coffee scrub which I have got right here. Guys this stuff is amazing. I've come up with like a miracle recipe or something. This does the exact same thing and I think I actually like this better. I put it on, I had a shower this morning and put it on. My skin feels so moisturized and I can still smell the coffee smell lingering on my skin. If you guys would like to learn how to make this then just keep on watching. <laughs> So starting off, I'm taking some coffee. This is really rich in antioxidants, which is amazing for your skin. It also smells amazing, is gonna make your skin really moisturized, and the caffeine simulates your blood, which is going to help get rid of cellulite. I'm now taking some raw sugar, which is gonna act as an exfoliant. And now I'm gonna take some cocoa powder because the Frank body scrub with the cocoa powder in it smells amazing, so I thought I would add some cocoa powder to my recipe. I'm also going to take some coconut oil and just like the coffee, this is also really rich in antioxidants so it's going to make your skin feel amazing. And lastly I'm going to take some cinnamon, cinnamon and this is really good if you have acne or eczema or any other skin infections because um, it's going to get rid of that and it also will make your skin nice and plump. You can keep your coffee scrub in a jar like this one, but I'm using it for my tips at the moment, so I'm just gonna use some boring little containers. So I'm taking a bowl and a spoon, and starting off, I'm just going to put in the coffee and the sugar and stir it together. I'm then gonna add the cocoa powder and stir that in as well. And then I'm also gonna add the cinnamon. And again, stir that in as well. <laughs> Now this is where it got a little bit messy but basically I'm just taking the coconut oil and I'm putting it into the bowl and I kind of added a little bit more after this but yeah at first I tried to use a spoon but it was really messy. I mean it was really hard sorry so I just ended up using my fingers which was really messy. Once it was all stirred together I just put it in the little containers and you're done. To use the scrub, I basically just take a small amount at a time and I scrub it onto my skin, which is wet. Um, obviously, I would generally do this in a shower, but I'm not going to film in the shower. And you can put it on your face as well. And once you're done, all you have to do is wait five minutes for it to dry and then rinse it off. That's it for this video, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it and found it helpful. And definitely let me know if you try out the scrub or you try to make it. I hope that you have a wonderful day. Make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you next time. Bye.